So, um, I want to do a couple techniques using the, the tail of the lapel. Um, usually when you start your match, then it's all tucked in. She's obviously not wearing her belt, so it's going to be untucked. But um, I like to make contact. With, it's something I've been doing a lot lately. Is I, I typically have my right hand stance, but once I make grip, she makes a grip. I like to switch my stance. So I'll go over the top, get a collar grip, and then switch my stance. That way I can untuck this lapel. Um, I could probably do it from here, but that's the way I've been setting it up lately. It's going here and really putting pressure. I like to get my elbow on the other side. That way I'm kind of dominating the inside space there. Um, because from here, she, she's controlling like that inside space. So if I can get my grip and drop this elbow, now she has to try to either re-pommel or like I have a really solid grip here. And then I'll, I'll grab, I'll untuck, and then, and then I'll get a good hold of it there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to look to sit. When I, I see a lot of guard pull where they'll go foot on the hip and then sit, I like to hook right behind the knee. So I'll go here and then sit to where I have kind of a butterfly. So I'm hooking and that'll, that'll stop like that quick pass because sometimes like people will put their foot here and then they just pull you right by there. Or do kind of like a, like a leg drag almost. So here, untuck. And then when I go to sit, I'm gonna do hook, go here. And then this is good too because I can pull with all this and then get it around the throat oh. there. All right, so this, we call it the jigsaw but I'm sure there's other names for it. That's just what we started calling it too. So I can yell out jigsaw and then boom, to it. I'm not gonna know what you're talking about. I know, but that's why I won't say it to you. Yeah. So as, as I'm sitting, I'm just kind of pulling with my hooks and pulling with this, this collar, ready to put this around the throat. So I go here, here, okay? And then we'll go into what we're gonna do next. It's just getting that set up first. So here, she got her grip. I go over the top, drop my elbow in, step, step. Untuck, and then I'm gonna, since I'm here, I could go for other takedowns, but I'm gonna re-square, hook. As I'm sitting, pull, and get it right around the throat. There. So. Depending on how long their lapel is, like it's gonna either be here or it's gonna be further through. Like if they have a longer lapel, it, it'll end up over here. But she's got a baby D, so now we're here. Which is, this is fine too. 